Hello, my lovely Sagittarians! Welcome to November. Single Sagittarians, this is your reading. Sun, Moon, Rising, Signs, and Venus for the month of November, of course. Let's see, darlings, what do we have for you for November. And thank you for all of you who did request this reading. So here it is. November for singles. Singles, you are definitely with no one, not married, not committed. Let's see, loves. What do we have for you, darlings, in this month that's quite shortly approaching? I'm having a page of swords. I'm having a ten of swords. I have queen of cups. The world and Ace of Cups. It seems here for many, many of you, Sagittarius, who will have a new beginning after something here ended and ended very, it's kind of ended with a heavy heart. For others of you, you finally could let go a situation and the world being as a major arcana for you, you have a new beginning. And now, speaking of, could be in love, could be in other energies, but definitely you do have it. Aces speaks about opportunities. I give in. It's up to you if you are going to allow it or not. It's kind of a, a let go situation. It's not like the situation could end some sometimes in the past or for some time, but I see you finally could let go of something. Let's see what this is about, loves. First card we have the Emperor, Five of Wands. Two of Pentacles and Six of Swords. There is movement. Whatever here you let go, I feel here you've been guided to let it go. And why it's so? I feel here there is way too many people involved or have been involved in that situation that you left. Or could be a lot of back and forth, back and forth. The Six of Swords definitely speaks here that it's hard to let go. Because I see some of you have been thinking a lot. Should I or should I not? But here you are. For others of you, it is a person left finally. And kind of not bother you any longer. If there was a person here, married or committed, they finally will let you go. Call it both ways. As a general reading, could be you left someone or someone left you. But I feel here a very stubborn energy here. Left. Let's see. Or you did left it. Let's see here. Why is this emperor here? Father of you, you needed to stay on your position, regardless of the situation. And if was not in a different way or was not coming in the middle or on the same page, then shall be. Let's see. The emperor... Temperance, Four of Swords, there's a lot of healing, darlings. Oh, yes. For some of you, you finally overcome a karmic situation, loves. That didn't go anywhere with this Five of Cups. Too much hurt. And you know, enough is enough. Too much hurt from, you know, certain things. 
what also I am hearing for some of you loves definitely there was a third party out there the third parties speaking because many of you have questions about third parties a third party is that party that is in between you and something you would like to or connect with that's a third party including could be a person could be a situation could be some kind of excess whatever that is could be other people could be differences between certain people and so on and having these three fives the only five is missing is five of pentacles five of pentacles speaks about left behind something here needed to be left behind either you felt left behind or someone here felt left behind the fact here that we have this two of pentacles something here worked for a while but didn't work you know going ahead and that that's why needed to be left behind for some reason i see you as this emperor as we have here the aries energies the leo energy your energy here it's kind of like you gather all yourself to move forward. So many, many of you Sagittarius, single Sagittarians, you are gonna move forward this month from a situation or that situation is gonna lift up, okay? I wanna one more card next to this Five of Swords before we go into the Two of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles. Yes, this is about for many many of you a person for others of you could be a money work situation so speaking about that five of um, pentacles it's right here some of you you could left a job or you are leaving a job either it's way demanding it's way too much but the fact is accepting a new beginning. Some of you, you are definitely going to change even the, the company you're working. For others of you, you might want to go back to school. Definitely certain changes are happening and needs to happen. Whatever these changes are, are necessary. Not because you want it, not because you, you are required, but unnecessary. The two of pentacles here, eight of pentacles, working towards your pentacles, working towards your future. If you did not want to, now you will. You choose to work on certain things. For others of you, your focus is going to change towards something else. And this is happening this month, inclusive next month, half month. Because full moon in Gemini, it's on December 15. Okay. Whatever here you do, definitely is towards the best outcome. Yes, you do take responsibility for the things and moving forward and working towards those. Yeah, absolutely, you make a decision. You are making a decision. The Six of Swords here. We have a Tower. We have an Ace of Pentic, Ace of Wands, and a Queen of Swords. And Justice. All right. For those of you who left a person, a partner, or whoever left you behind, or you left behind, I see someone here wants to reconcile with you. I don't feel this person loves you or it's their full love. 
but it's more likely for something they need from you. Whatever that could be. And for others, you find the strength, the clarity, what you should do next. Okay, what's next? I also see just for um, for some of you there is um there's a legal situation here clarifies or you get results from a legal situation if you are in one of them. This is just something specific I'm picking up. But let's see here what's next? What's next for you? Page of Cups. So we have two pages and two queens. As above, as below. Many of you, if you were like in this two of pentacles, back and forth, back and forth regards the situation, you now will know clearly what's ahead or what you should go. And that's a new beginning. This is a, uh, more like a renewal in your life in many, many areas. Many of you single Sagittarius, you get renewal in your life. And some of you who look for work, job, whatever here you look for, it's on the way to you. If you look for love, it's on the way to you. If you look for work, there is an offer coming in. There's something here new and it's coming in very quick or right after you let go this. The sun usually represents the zodiac sign of Leo. However, in the time frame or timeline, this is within a day or in the daytime. For some of you, you might just go to an interview and they say, well, you are the right candidate, we are picking you. If you go meet a person, this person is just like, I'm happy that I found you. There's something here about that it's a matter of a day to know that you are going on the right path or on the right track. So whatever here is, if you try to find some kind of information, it's going to take a day to find it very very quick some it's kind of within a day you you will know how the things go how the things move what else comes for you darlings or is there for you in this month of november hangman the knight of swords Ten of Cups and the Six of Wands. What I'm picking up, there's a there's a situation out there that it seems kind of too little, too late. For those of you who are waiting for a person, or that person waits something from you, that's not gonna happen anymore. I'm, uh, I'm hearing that whatever here was postponed or, or impending or not going anywhere is going to start going very fast. For some of you, there is a person here that's coming back, but it's kind of too little too late because a lot of things changed between you two. No matter who they are, what they are. Yeah, the Hermit, High Priestess, Seven of Cups, Three of Swords, Nine of Wands. Whoever is this person, it's very hard for them to get out of their comfort zone. And when they decide it's kind of too little, too late. This this person or with this person happened not only once but a couple times before. And I don't feel it's only with you. Whoever is this person. It's just how is their nature or they are 
being. Okay. What I want to look in the deck is where is the Five of Pentacles. Because I uh, sense some of you had certain uh, problems, financial problems. And it seems here those are also over loves. But let's see what's around the Five of Pentacles or what's around that energy. So we can know what to expect. Oh, here it is. Okay. So five of pentacles is right here. Okay. The next card we have page and the two. Ten of wands, the devil, king of swords. Okay. So it seems here there is a person here that could get away or could try something, but they didn't get the way they should. Okay, so it seems here somebody might sound like unfinished business here. But this person definitely have been involved with other situation as well at the same time. For others of you, it's just your boss. Could be one just to keep you on a certain level that you feel like you deserve a, a different and if this person tried to keep you small, that's why you left, whatever you left. So whatever here is, Spirit says, you do you. But let's see one advice. Single Sagittarius, advice for you for November, no matter which area resonates. For some reason, I feel here there's a lot of Sagittarius that are going to watch this reading. And everyone will get a little teeny tiny message. What advice we have for you, loves? Empress. Grow. Expand. Never put your life on hold for anyone or anything. Ten of Wands. Even though you work hard for what you do, you are going to get beautiful results. Here is your Ten of Pentacles. For uh, many, many of you, loves, look at this tens. We have all the tens. The only one ten, it's Major Arcana, Jupiter, the Wheel of Fortune. Look at here. For some of you, you are going to end a very difficult time in your life. And there is just flourishing. For some of you, there is a project that you finally finish. And then you're going to get paid or get results. There's certain things here starts to grow and expand and the full. Wow. There's definitely a lot of movement. However, I have a, um, a little, I don't know how to say request or little warning. Be aware of those people who left you when you've been in the hardest time because they might return. Be aware of those who, who put you in the hard times, actually, that they might try to return, okay? The full energy here is telling you, you don't need to worry about whoever comes back, but toward where you are heading. So many, many of you, you are heading towards a new energy but since many of you asking, because I see he's like, just tell us about why the warning. Okay, why those people wants to return? Or what's the reason somebody would return if they left even? You know, everybody has their own reasons. But let's see. Why somebody here would want to return or what's the reason? Because they feel like the connection with you, it's still there. Six of Cups speaks about memories, speaks about the past, speaks about familiarity. I know you, but they don't know you. Okay. Five of Pentacles. We cannot leave. It's it's a it's quite obvious. Somebody here could realize 
that they lost you and then it's it's impossible here to come back but also for some of you 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 burn the bridges with certain people and they feel sorry for that here is the knight of wands for some of you yes you you are very sorry but whoever are these people or whoever here tries to come back or tries to you know they come as like new or they come with this offer of big it's something here that many people could not say no or couldn't reject will you accept this or you are not it's kind of somebody here whoever left or whoever left you in the hard times they want to make it up will will you accept them queen of wands four of wands eight of cups and king of swords it's a hot cold energy between you two but more likely i'm feeling the energy of i'm i'm fine where i am and i'm fine where i build not where we build so it's kind of whoever here tries to come back might have no place here yes they will try i also have here someone even are gonna say certain words don't listen to those words okay whoever is this person they are still the same okay and for some of you you are not interested in them so sagittarius do you darlings but yes, there is still some kind of reminiscence energy here from someone. But overall, I see you going beautifully into something amazing and new. Like this beautiful sun. Love and light, darlings. Have a lovely, lovely month. And I'll see you next time. Bye for now.